Welcome back to another template focus here at Brizzy. My name is JP. And before we continue, remember to subscribe, give us a like for this video, even if you haven't watched it yet, and visit us at Brizzy.io. So cryptocurrency, a very big thing. A lot of people are into it. And that means that there is also a big need for website templates for it. This one can be a little bit tricky because the design really needs to speak to the aesthetics of what Bitcoin cryptocurrency is all about. What we have here is a great crypto things website. It is dark. It gives you that modern business feeling. And for some reason, people do think of cryptocurrency as something a little bit more professional, something a little bit mysterious. Great infographics that you have here, a great info box section with your features. You have a view pricing list there. And then this kind of design is repeated with nice counters where you can easily add some data that will give people more information about your site. A great info box section for services or features that you like to present here. And then very important, you're going to need your testimonials. This is done with our carousel slider. We'll talk a bit more about that. Manual post section, you want to be featured in the news. And then at the very bottom, we have two global blocks. One is for your lead collection. And then the other one is where to download the app. There is also a footer, but for some reason, I think I, oh, there is the footer. For a moment, I thought I didn't have the footer here. I just scroll down and the menu appears there again. All good. About page, about page, very well done. Really had to go even and look at how the design team had done this because I really liked that border. And then as this is a pro template for Brizzy WordPress and Brizzy Cloud, you see the timeline element comes in here. And if you ever wonder, you know, what you can do with the timeline element, this is a very good example. It's nice. It's clean. It's minimal. I do like this way. Your investors, a little bit of social proof that you need there. And then your team. Again, you have that mysterious, we work in dark rooms kind of crypto effect. We get to the bottom with our repeated global blocks for our lead collection, the app that we want to introduce. Let's go to use case. And I think just for a moment there, I'll pause because that app and your lead collection is the main feature of what you want to achieve with this. You want people who are interested in cryptocurrency to reach out to you and to learn more about cryptocurrency because many people have no idea what it is. This is still a wide open area. And if you have a client that is looking for a website, this website, design template starter site demo is going to do it for them. So on our use case, this is where we will be looking at all the different ways of which you can be using this. You have more infographics here and you can see the same design is repeated. That consistency, very important. Here's the carousel I mentioned earlier. We also had that at the testimonials. This is really nice just to have this in and give a little bit of interaction here. And you can also put on the autoplay. So a little bit of news. That design that we saw on the previous page with nice columns. And then we have our three global sections again at the bottom for the lead collection. The pricing page is going to highlight all the plans. And I see there's a slight mistake here. You just will need to switch the monthly and the annual. Because if that was the monthly charge, I think you'll be leaving the site very, very soon. So this is monthly. And then we have annual. A pro element is the switcher. So this is not a pricing element. This is the switcher element with pricing tables inside designed from scratch. And you can just copy this. And I even think that if you have another website where you need a kind of switcher with pricing options like this, all you do is go, you import this page, you delete all the other blocks you don't need, and you keep this one and the global styling will do the rest. Here we are again at our carousel and all our testimonials. Important to have respectable people there. To the end we go. And then the last part will be our contact form. The contact page, very, very basic, a place for people to contact. And we have the lead collection. Keep in touch with the latest. So this is our page that we have here. And what I've shown you is done both in WordPress and Brizzy. If you want to know more about the templates, just hop on over to Brizzy.io and you can see templates. And we've changed the name to websites. Now I'm going to talk a little bit soon about the Brizzy Cloud template section now as well, which has changed considerably how you import these starter templates in Brizzy Cloud. Brizzy WordPress, you know how to do it. So for us to get the cryptocurrency 
under business, you will find all those templates that are related to the business and then our crypto things over here. And if you want to know how this look, preview design. So I mentioned to you that Brizzy Cloud has changed. Let's create a new project. And this is where everything changes. All these templates are now here. And you will see your first selection is project type. And then your second selection is choose website. If you want to start from scratch, then you click on start with this design. And that's going to give you a clean one. Let's go to business. And then we look again for our good friend crypto things. There we go. Start with this design. And just like the cloning process has worked up to this point, it's going to take you less than 15 seconds for this website to import with all the content, all the pages, all the menus, the global blocks, the works, all set up. And there we go. So let the spinning wheels continue. And we are into Brizzy Cloud right from the Brizzy Cloud dashboard. We have imported this time much more convenient. You don't have to go to the website and look at that all looking hunky dory. There is our, what do you call that again? Carousel. And there we go. So let's have a look quickly at in terms of our assets here. If I go over to our content management system and we have a look at the pages that have been imported, we have our pages. You can see, in fact, we have six there. The home page itself is connected to the logo. So that's not brought in. And if we go over to our use case, just to have a quick look here, I think this is where we were looking at the carousel. You can see that what we have here is our carousel element, and you can put it on autoplay, change the columns, add more. You can have a lot of content in there. I would select the autoplay for this feature so that it can scroll automatically and draw the attention to your user that there is more to it than meets the eye. Right, um, content management system, we can go into our about page. Let's go have a look at the timeline, which as I mentioned is a pro element. And this is available for cloud and WordPress. All what I'm showing you, you're going to find the same in WordPress and cloud. Yes, I wanna have a look at this. So we have our, what do you call this? We have our block here and then we have a column. And what has happened with the column styling is you have it on 25% to the left and right. So we bring in the content very nicely to the middle, give it a lot of negative space. And then border has been added at the right and to the left of one pixel. And that's how you get that very, very nice boxed in effect. So for this one, the border is also right and left, so it continues straight on down. Here is our time element timeline element, not time element. And again, you have these features that you can choose how you want it to display. I do like the stagger for this because the design lends itself to it being more staggered. And the interesting thing about the staggered, it also gives you that feeling of time, I almost said time dilution, but I'm not in astrophysics at the moment. It's a cryptocurrency website, the time evolving and how things have progressed for this site. And this is where you make all your changes in your timeline element. You can change out the icon, you can change out the text. And then the global styling, you can see this currently is a very dark theme. If you prefer something a little bit more brighter, this is where you go and make those changes because it's going to be so much easier. In WordPress, as I've mentioned, we do that very simply by going to the sidebar on the left and select under Brizzy Starter Templates. Here you have a little bit more search control and under Categories, I will just, yeah, you can go free pro, but then I just go to the search on the right and type in crypto because that's going to give me this site and it will give me a few other sites as well. So these are ones that are very suitable if you want to do a crypto website and you're looking for something that will fit that style and design. You see, we have crypto bold and crypto things. Delete existing content is always suitable for starting from fresh. And that was super quick. You have to agree with that. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Let's have a look if everything is as is on the front. And we expect it to be. There we go. Not too long. And we are getting very used to this website. You can see there is a back to the top in the right corner. That is not done with Brizzy. I'm using the Bloxy page, uh, Bloxy theme 
in the background and I just had tested it. So I left that back to top button on. So that's what you saw there. That is our crypto things, our crypto starter template for you. And if you want to know more about that, visit brizzy.io. Check out the links in the description below. We have a lot of links on resources that can really help you to elevate your web design, your web development, and your business. From me, JP, I'll see you in the next video. Remember, did you subscribe? Did you give us a like? Yes? Then good. Enjoy your day.